The boat that we brought down here is just like the 47 supercharged boat we build for our customers worldwide. Everybody thinks the cats are the fastest boats. Doesn't seem to be that way out on the race course, so we'll see what it is out here on the poker run course. You know, we hear about all these fast boats, but wherever we go, we don't usually find them. We just want to see what the, the cats are doing here. We want to see what the uh, other V-bottoms of our competitors are doing here just to keep ourselves stacked up as to uh, where we are today. I'm gonna actually go up on the plane and be talking to my guys at the boat so I can look at all the boats out there and see who's doing what and what it looks like, like it's doing so we can go back and know what kind of homework we have to do, if any. We heard about 180 mile an hour boats and that's why we brought this boat here because we know exactly how fast we're going. We have all kinds of technology that tells us how fast we're going. We were like 17th on the start with all the boats. There wasn't a real good definite start, and our goal was to be the number one boat at the first checkpoint. We're working more handling than we are with actual speed because people are turning the boats faster, the power's improving. Uh, and the boats are going faster, so we're working on handling and setup as much as we are the speed. Speed is probably a third of the priorities. The cat boats in this calm water, it's definitely an advantage for them. One guy took off. He must have been out there a mile ahead of the start. At the start, we sucked them up and blew them away. And then about a mile from the bridge, we tracked those cats down and dusted them off. I was up in the air in a helicopter. The main thing there was to keep an eye where all these other boats were so we could make sure that we were out front. And one thing we tried to do, we, when we got so far ahead, I'd slow them down because all the other guys give up. We wanted them to max their stuff out. Those cats were so far behind at the first stop, they didn't even go up to the card stop. They waited outside to catch up and take a second shot at us. I saw him in the rear view mirror, and, and I knew we had a ways to go, so we pulled back uh, so he could catch up with us because uh, we wanted to film us pulling away from him. OK, boys, let's go now. Since there's no movie stars down there, bye-bye, pussycats. the strain and pain. Uh, I think ultimately he broke a motor. It was real loose. It was uh, running probably a little bit unsafe. So we had our eye on him. I, I didn't want anything bad to happen to him. Cats had every advantage today because of the, the calm water. Um, they had some of them had, had us on a jump start on the uh, very beginning, and we just out accelerated and not ran them to the first turn. We came here to find out really how fast these cat boats are because this boat is clearly we're campaigning it as the first overall fastest boat in the world. Well, we determined today that we're faster than anybody that was here. I guess we've heard enough about a 180 mile an hour cat, so. Ever how fast they went, we'll um, pick any speed they want. It was pretty clear we were faster. Now, we'd like to catch them out in the ocean one time with the waves three, four, five, and six foot because the difference would grow dramatically. 